Hey guys, welcome to another lunchtime review. Today I'm going to try this Eglin's Best Breakfast Bowl. This, these are new. This is a loaded potato scramble. It says it has eggs, potato, onion, cheddar cheese, bacon, and green onions, which sounds awesome. Um, seven ounces or 198 grams for the meal. And let's see. 290 calories. Oh, we bought them at Meyer. It was $4.99, which is a little expensive for an egg-based meal, but whatever. We'll see. We'll see what it's like. Um, so they're 290 calories for the bowl. And there's your other info for you. And I think the directions, I think I saw them. Yeah. Turn this up a little bit. So we're going to remove film from carton and re remove from carton and remove film. Um, cook for two and a half minutes. Stir well place and place in microwave. Cook again for one minute or until thoroughly cooked. So we're basically going to do it for two and a half minutes, stir it up, and then do it for a minute. And we're going to remove the, the film. So that's unusual. There's no pull tab on here. So you just have to take a chance on the paper cut. Okay, there's what it looks like. So I'm going to, well, I can just pull this off right now. There we go. So I'm going to get this in the microwave. I'll be back. Okay, right, so here it is out of the microwave. I did let it sit for a minute, like they said. And um, lots of eggs, which is good. That's what you want. Lots of potatoes. I see some green onions and some peppers in there. Is that what it's had in there? Um, eggs, potato, onion, cheddar cheese, bacon, and green onions. I don't know. I guess it's, I guess it's bacon. Yeah, I guess it's bacon. I thought it was red peppers at first, but no, I guess now I'm looking at it better. It does look like bacon. So anyway, I'm going to take this over the table and uh, give it a try. Okay, I just carried it over here. I didn't give it any time to cool off. So I got potato, bacon, eggs, some onion, you know, everything. Here we go. Well, not bad. It's good. It's, um, I don't think it'll blow you away, but it's definitely not bad. I'll tell you what I like about it. The textures are good. The egg is cooked well. You get the little pieces of bacon in there. The potatoes, some of them are very, very soft and other ones are kind of, not hard, but they're firmer. Like that one's almost just barely cooked. I mean, it's, it's kind of still crunchy. Um, so in that respect, it depends on how you like your potatoes. I like mine a little softer because um, literally I can hear myself crunching through the potato when I'm eating it. Um, Again, you might like that little more texture in your potato. I personally like them a little softer. But um, the eggs, like I said, they're, they're fine. They're not rubbery or hard or chewy or anything like that. So the eggs are nice. The bacon's nice. Potatoes are a little underdone, just a little bit. Um, the egg, the onions are also fine. They're green onions, and they've still got that little chew like you do in a green onion. Um, so texture-wise, it's okay. It's not bad. It's kind of in the middle. Uh, Flavor-wise, it's also kind of in the middle. It's uh, You really taste the potato. There's a really strong potato flavor in there. When you get a piece of the bacon, you do taste the bacon. And you get the flavor of the green onion. Um, actually, probably the, with the exception of the potato, probably the green onion is the next strongest flavor you get. I don't really taste the cheese, but I'm, I never taste cheese and stuff. Um, that's just a lot of it or it's really strong. Um, you do get the bacon when you get pieces of it. You do taste that smoky bacon. So it's just, it's okay. It's nothing, um, it's like a blow your mind. It's not awesome. It's not the best thing ever. Um, it is good, but it's just, to me, it's just kind of just an average scramble. Um, you can make something like this yourself at home. If you bought um, the frozen potato squares and cook them up, and then added scrambled eggs and peppers and onions and maybe some crumbled up bacon. You can make this exact same thing at home, probably probably for about five dollars, but make a lot more of it. Um, so I'm gonna give this one a three out of five. It's good. It's not awesome. It's good. It's edible. It's definitely uh, food. Um, I don't think it's gonna stay with you very long because it is mostly egg and potato, and I think that's gonna kind of you'll be hungry in another couple of hours. So just keep that in mind. So um, try it out if you like it. Uh, but you're not missing anything if you don't. <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.